Let's bring in 11 Alive's Ariana Manise now to continue our team coverage. Ariana, you are live in Midtown Force this morning where this all unfolded. What can you tell us about the alleged suspect? Well, Aisha and Shiro, there's still a lot to learn about the deadly shooting that happened here in Midtown, like the suspect's name, which police have not yet confirmed and a motive. Now take a look at your screen. We have video of the moments that the suspect was taken into custody at the Atlanta airport after an hours long search. Now, although police, they haven't determined a motive, documents they are revealing both victims were among more than a dozen named in a job discrimination lawsuit filed by the suspect earlier this summer. Now, it's one of two lawsuits that the suspect is a part of against the building management company of 1280 West where the shooting occurred. Now the suspect claims to be a whistleblower and that the company and managers named in this lawsuit violated her civil rights. But as of right now, police are not saying how the suspect knew the victims, but they do believe the victims were targeted and police say as of right now, they will release the suspect's name at the appropriate time as this will be the center of their investigation. Back to you. Ariana, thank you. And so as you see, this story is still developing. We are working to get more answers from law enforcement as they continue their investigation today. We will update you on air and online at 11alive.com as we continue to learn more.